Welcome to another tutorial on MATLAB. In this episode, we are looking into the truth table aspect of state flow. And in this tutorial, we will see what is the use cases of a truth table and where we should actually use it. So there are multiple use cases that is possible, but the major three use cases are on the screen as you can see. So the first use case is fault detection. So suppose you have some system in that there are multiple type of faults. Um, you can consider as one electrical system or any mechanical system. There will be multiple level of faults. There could be faults in the system. There could be faults in the controller. There could be faults in the sensors. So there are multiple possibilities are there when there will be a fault. So to detect every fault, we can have a truth table which will uh, do detection of the fault and it will also categorize based on the truth table which type of fault it is there in the system so based on that we can take necessary actions so that is the one use case of the truth table where we will be applying our truth table could be an electrical system or any mechanical system or any mechatronic system anything is possible yeah the second use case is mode switching. So suppose you have different modes in a uh, vehicle. Suppose um, you are driving a vehicle and you did something and which is uh, activating some mode in the vehicle. Or uh, you are uh, flying a plane and there is some uh, actions that happened or some scenario that got created and uh, that is being supposed uh, sense uh, by the sensor and uh, suppose one of the sensor in the flight got failed then in that scenario uh, the mode switching will happen and the flight will uh, go in a different uh, maneuver or in different way it is not expected to go that way but as the uh, fault is getting activated and uh, or something is being detected uh, in the sensors you are switching the mode of flight uh, to different dif scenarios based on that you will be switching the mode and you will be taking different action so that is a uh, one example of mode switching and uh, there could be multiple modes based on which the uh, system will operate so we need uh, basically a truth table to deal with the same as the decisions will be very complex and uh, the switching need to be accurate based on the truth value of different scenarios. So that is why uh, we need uh, mode switching uh, and the mode switching uses a truth table in um, such scenarios. Next is the fault management. So in the in case of fault management, as we already seen that we are able to detect some fault in the first scenario, but um, somehow we need to take uh, some management action to mitigate the fault. Uh, we need to know like whether the fault is uh, permanent or it is transient or it is temporary. So based on that, we will take different different actions. So um, based on those um, scenarios, we need to manage our fault. Um, fault in such cases so such things are usually called uh, fault management and in that type of scenarios we will be using the truth table to take different different decisions based on the truth value of different different scenarios so basically what uh, we understood over here whenever there is a complex logic and there will be multiple inputs and those inputs could have multiple uh, scenarios or multi can have multiple values in that case you will be um, better using a state uh, truth table uh, state flow truth table which will take uh, necessary actions and it will tell you like uh, what action you should take based on these truth values so uh, whatever the inputs that you will be giving or whatever the inputs that it will be getting from the sensors so based on that it will take the decision and that decisions will be accurate and predetermined also so this will help uh, to take the proper decisions while uh, dealing with complex system so that is how um, we can use our truth tables to ma manage different scenarios in complex systems so that is how um, the use cases of truth table is there 
so uh, it is very important to know the truth table um, so in uh, dealing with such complex system this is all about the use cases of truth table in the coming tutorial we will implement a, a truth table for fault management system so there is suppose multiple um, faults and activated and based on that we need to take some actions so how to implement a fault uh, implementation scenario or fault management scenario in a truth table we will see in the coming tutorial in case you are liking the channel please consider subscribing in case you have any comment or query please let us know in the comment section so that it will help us to improve your experience of learning matlab in this channel have a good day and Take care.